Um, I'm just wondering whether you remember the Derby match in 1967 at Goodison, FA Cup, fifth round, and it was shown on a big screen at Anfield at the That's same right. time. That's right. Do you remember it? Yeah, I do. I played in it. Did you? I was goalkeeper for Liverpool. Really? Yeah. Oh, well, that's a stroke of luck, me meeting <laughs> nice. you. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, can you remind me of your name? Tommy Lawrence. Tommy, nice to meet you. What, what do you remember about it? It was a great game, yes. Alan Ball scored the winner. He did indeed. Yeah, he did, yeah. ABC TV engineers and technicians fought against Gales to make possible an experiment which resulted in the biggest crowd for a cup tie in history. Eight huge screens, 30 feet by 40, were put up on the pitch at Anfield, Liverpool's home ground, for here a capacity crowd were to watch the Merseyside Cup battle, Everton versus Liverpool. Ida 4 projectors would relay, live from the Everton arena, the entire game. A further 65,000 had snapped up all the tickets at Goodison Park. As last-minute technical adjustments were made, crowds flocked to the Liverpool ground. Tickets for the live relay were sold out within 36 hours. The gate was worth £12,000. The crowd filed in, but the dressing rooms were deserted. It was a few miles away where the two teams took to the field. But the enthusiasm at Anfield, as battle commenced on the giant screens, was as electric as at Goodison Park, where 22 men were battling for a place in the sixth round. There was a moment of drama for television engineers as one of the screens, anchored by eight tons of steel, was slightly lifted for a second or two by a gust of wind. But for the 105,000 people watching the match live at Everton and over the direct TV link, the drama was being played out before their eyes. At last, ball had it in the net for Everton. The moment was shared as it happened by two massive crowds miles from each other, but linked by modern science. ABC TV's experiment had proved a major success.